is Oppo Lower's full mount case. Like I said, even though we mount it with a Dr. Bite, so we get the vertical dimension. The issue is the, the length is really long already. So what did I do? And then I just decreased the, the vertical dimension just a little bit. Size of the occlusion. Once you set up, and then I want to go to the lower first because this is my this is my length. That's good. Once you set up, the same thing, same height, same height. That's good. Like you said, too long. That's fine. The minimum as possible. That area. And then here, everything's good. Alright, this is horizontal is good, premolar is good, if it thinks too high, just cut it here. If we have a room, okay, I'm trying to delete it, that's good. So, I got this horizontally, it's still high here, can cut it if we have a room, alright, it's just a little bit longer than this, okay, so you make a little bit longer, the other canine. So I recall curve of speed. Okay. Now, once you set up this, I'm trying to reduce as much as possible, thin as possible. Then I make the alignment about this. So we make a little bit here. Thanks. That's good. Okay. Same thing the other side, but you have to make thin as possible the facial. I would say 5 tenths millimeter. This is a matter, you can go down 4 tenths millimeter, I'm okay. So once you set up the 4 tenths, the same thing. 4 tenths millimeter. And then I want good alignment. Looks like here has a slightly lack of room, but thin as possible. So I can make the good alignment. You can make slightly out compared to this canine. Like this. Alright. Primolo is okay. And then here good. Maybe a little bit. So once you set up the, the incisor height, then good. Alright. Now we go over the top. So we have this now. Still to me a little bit high and they make a little bit more down to vertical. That's good. Alright now more comfortable. Now same thing. 8 and 9 horizontal. Alright, this lateral is short, so you have to make the longer than the other side. Like this. Alright? Good. Now K9 to K9. Nice, slightly longer. Just cut it and the other side a little bit cut it. Okay. Now same thing. Here is it you can add it lateral. Okay. So now I go middle line. And I have a one twos, two twos, three twos, four twos. Same thing, one twos, two twos, and then K9. Now, the more important is occlusion, same thing, we need to get it. You dictated one side as thin as possible, I don't want to make the wheel, it is, here's a little problem for lateral, but we'll be okay, so we're going to make the crown like this, not like that. So, we have to make thin, but you have to add more here, bring it in, see, so you are supporting porcelain. Like that. Still, I, I'm okay, but except here. Once you set up the central teeth, here's a pony, big same level. Okay. This is a little bit semi precious matter. It's a lot of gold nerve. Involve the same. Alright. So here is the final. So you add a little bit more under. Right? So you can support. Okay. 
so you have the cent central same right. and the lateral a little bit out is okay compared to this so which is this just a little bit I think not too much just a little bit down like this canine okay fine to add it so now here's a challenge over here so you have to make really thin as possible this so your shape will be like that so i got the good proper canine will be here so i'm going to cut it here not that so i can get compensate premolar to to me only like a proper one so you have to make thin as possible here I can cut here with this so I make the proper canine right same alignment I do not need much to linger because this is a porcelain fused matter cut it so then premolar then that's good it's a four mouse case so we finish the wax up and then um, cast matter with the semi precious matter. Now we got the really good design about central size, lateral, and canine, and the vertical size. Usually, four mouth case has a little is all the time the discrepancy. So, you give them resin pattern. I hope that one is good. So, when doctor try in the patient's mouth, right, so they can make the stop. If it's good, awesome, take the bite. But if it's not good, just like what I did, what we did, and then you can do with another pattern, and um, they can take the good bite stop. So I just let Dr. Vincent Forney know. So he have to do those kinds of direction. Anyway, the full mouse case. On the way. It's not one of the full mouse cases. Which is Splint together. So we trying to get the good centric bite. Okay. So we got cusp to fossa relationship pattern. The focal corridor is all splinted. Splint together. Right. So we do have a little bit limitation but room compared to the other side. We make it a little bit thicker. So make it better. Focal contour. It's good amount of a translucency so we make this all right and down um, here is more okay so we make the good cantilever panty here so that to take the pick up impression so we have to be remounted and then we finish all this stuff nice Subscribe to Luke Kong's Patreon for private ongoing training for dental technicians, lab owners, and aspiring lab owners, as well as valuable education from a lab site perspective for dentists. For just $25 a month, you can train with Luke Kong online via live videos with live chat Q&A sessions, and ongoing dialogue exclusively on Patreon. This offer is ideal for dental lab technicians, lab owners, aspiring lab owners, and dentists. Subscribe today.